Hi everyone, today I have a deck review on the Gold Bicycle Carnival playing cards. You can get this deck of cards at bmpokerworld.com in the link in the description. So this here is the next deck in the Carnival series. On the front of the box, it's very similar to previous Carnival decks, but the coloring is in gold. It says Bicycle Carnival playing cards and there is a spade in the middle with a skeleton figure. One side says the U.S. Playing Card Company, Erlinger, Kentucky. The other side says Air Cushion Finish, Made in the USA. The bottom has a seven of spades barcode reveal and some copyright info. The back shows the back design. And this deck does not have a seal on the box. This is the back design. Again, it's very similar to previous carnival decks. The difference here is the coloring, so it has gold metallic inks on there. I've never really felt that the contrast between the white and the metallic gold made the gold pop very much, but this deck does have a lot of that gold on there, so it stands out pretty well. The deck comes with a few extra cards. There's a blank face card and a Big Blind Media ad card. The two jokers look like a skeleton that's praying. They have wings on them and it looks like they're on their knees, their hands together, and one of them has a reveal between the hands. And this is the Ace of Spades. It's black. I would have imagined it to be gold, but I also think the black stands out better on the card than a gold one would. The rest of the cards have completely standard faces. The handling of the deck isn't the best, but it's still pretty good. It has an air cushion finish and a standard bicycle stock. It might be the ink on the cards or something that just makes them feel a little bit less secure in the hand. And I'm not saying the handling itself is bad. The cards just kind of seem to warp easier. But they still hold up all right. Here's the shuffle. The springs are decent quality. And the fans with this deck are fairly even. And there's a spread. And although I've struggled to get a perfect pharaoh with this deck, the pharaohs are not bad at all. This is what a giant fan looks like. So these are our final thoughts on this deck. It seems to lack some creativity and customization on the faces of the cards, but I do understand why a lot of companies use them because without a, a lot of artwork going on on the cards, it makes it more practical to actually use them for performing. So if you're one that really likes customization, then you know this deck doesn't offer that. However, the back design has this really nice gold metallic color that kind of makes up for the lack of it on the front. And the handling is good, even though the deck can sometimes feel somewhat warped. So that's my review on the Bicycle Carnival Gold. You can get this deck at bmpokerworld.com in the link in the description. Thank you for watching.